Mom? I don't want to cause any alarm or anything, but the oven's not turning on anymore. Just uh, turn the dial, Greg? Yeah, I turned the dial. How long ago did you turn it on? Like 20 minutes ago, and it's still not. Still nothing's happened. What's the thermometer say? Twenty minutes. Yeah. Mom, it's, it's gonna be okay. We can get another one. Who do I? Who do I call? We can. Why don't we just get a new one? I, the light. The light works, but. No, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. I can't believe this. It's been 30 years I've had old yeller. What are you making, Mom? I'm gonna make apple pie, and then I'm gonna cheat like nobody's business. If I can remember how to do this. Yeah, stick it there. Hmm. Well, maybe I don't stick it there. <laughs> uh, maybe go back here. I make apple pie approximately every two years, and it's mm. time. Mom yeah. said, Craig, do you want me to make apple pie? I was like, uh, yep. Why am I making apple pie, Craig? Do you <laughs> For know? For a video. Because why, though? What? Because people like them. There might be something. There's, I have a new appliance, and it's not this apple peeler. Uh, yeah, when did we get that? The, this? Oh! That. Yeah, that. I mean, that, that's one thing that the, the YouTube land, they're going to notice. Yeah. Like, oh! Oh, golly gee, tiddlywinks! Oh, you didn't center it, did you? I don't know what I did. Oh my. <laughs> Woo, that looks good. <laughs> Let's try this way. Hmm. For first, you don't succeed. Quit. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. I think we're gonna set that one aside, and I'll use the the hand-operated. You can just uh, eat that. No, I can use a hand peeler. I do know how to peel things by oh. hand. All right. But I'm gonna have to try to, uh, which is the whole the whole reason I don't make apple pie that often is because it's kind of a pain to peel things. Mm -hmm. So in light of that, and what happens if you don't peel them? You can get away with not peeling them for things like apple crisp, but I feel like apple pie you've gone too far if you don't peel them for apple pie. Yeah. That's why it's a little it's ridiculous to not peel them for apple pie. Woo! When it's so easy. Okay. See. You can't beat that with a ball peen hammer. Well, do you have a ball peen hammer on you? I don't know what that is. Yeah, I don't either. It's just something my brother says. Okay, so we want six cups of peeled sliced apples. Be sure to use, first of all, you always want to use a tape measure to hold your place. Yep. And you want to use that cookbook. How old is this? I believe I purchased it when I moved out of the house at the age of 18. So, so that was back in 1823? No, he was 1923 actually. Oh, okay. So, yeah, it was 1982, 81, 1981. Yeah. It's quite a while ago. Let's just, let's just say that and move on. If you can't boot up your um, red peeling machine, you want to use one of these. Mm -hmm. This is a hand peeler. I can't believe I'm using this because this is the whole reason why I don't make apple pie. Oh, you know what that sound is? That means my 
brand new oven. It's now preheated. Up, all up to speed, or so we think. Yeah. I do have a thermometer thingy hanging in there to see how accurate it is. And you know what? I read in the the reading manual. Yeah. If it's off by a little bit, you can recalibrate it yourself. No way. Yeah. There's actual it's crazy talk. directions. I read the flim flam and manual. Dad, how do you feel about apple pie? I love apple pie. Awesome. I heard that for your birthday we had apple pie instead of cake. Is that true? That's right. Can you substantiate that rumor? True story. Of course, his birthday is at Easter time, and Mommy doesn't have time to make apple pie at Easter time, so we actually had to order it from a vegan bakery and pay for it. And mm -hmm. I think it was like 30 bucks or something. Oh, yeah. Wow. I'm worth it. Though. Yep, you're worth yeah. it. Whereas this one is going to cost that bag of apples, their organic gala apples, was nine dollars. The pie crust, I think, was two fifty. Two fifty. And yeah, I'm being lazy and using Pillsbury pie crust. That's the other reason I don't make apple pie too often. Because but it's vegan. It's accidentally vegan. Uh, they just forgot to add the meat. Yeah, it happens. Yeah. Baconless crust. I mean, if you want to use it, you could make a. Uh, pot pie out of it and put meat in that way, but we're oh, not going to do that. We should do a pot pie recipe with like tofu or seitan or something. Or fake chicken. Yeah. I mean, basically we could take my um, chicken and biscuits stuff Ooh. and put that in a pie crust. Yeah. Wait, is there, a, is there a top to this crust? Yes, it's a two crust package. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Are you, wait, when you say there, is there a top to the crust, are you talking about the hypothetical chicken pot pie? No. Or are you talking well, about this apple I'm pie? Either one, I guess. Was I'm just talking about this specific one yeah. that you got in the box. Yeah, so there's two two crusts in there, which you can use it to make two open-faced pies, or you can use it to make one double-crust pie. Wow. And We're living in the future. Yes. I don't think I've ever actually used store-bought pie crust before, but... This will be a first. I wanted to test out my new oven, and it's October, and I don't have a lot of time to do stuff. I just got home from work. It's 7.15. The boss lets you... But you leave by seven. My boss is such a toughy. Yeah. She makes me stay until the work is done. Oh. Yeah. Can you believe it? Come on, catch. Oh, don't do it again. Oh no, please. Wow. <laughs> you just gotta learn how to put them on straight. <laughs> oh. I'll try the other end. Probably won't work, but. Well, I mean, one thing you want to do is use not, not huge apples, which I thought I, I did that in spades, but. Okay, okay that's better. Alrighty. Wow. So fast. Yeah. Okay, I'm done with the slicing and the dicing, and I'm now going to do the, uh, the sprinkly part. You want to mix up the stuff in this here recipe. Oh, and you're veganizing all this, huh? Because it says, it says butter. Oh, that's going to be a stretch. I know. But yeah. there's no no eggs or anything? No egg, Craig. No eggs. Huh, huh. The kids at Lemoyne, like the, you know, the kids that coach. I know you know that, but not everybody who watches the YouTubes knows that I'm a college coach at Lemoyne. Um, but a lot of the kids on the team will just say that I have no eggs all the time. Like, ah, uh, classic Craig and his lack of eggs. It's like, it's like their thing. Did one of your friends call you just... Just shortens it down to egg. Oh, that's Jordan. Which is the opposite of what you are. You're mm -hmm. no egg. Mm -hmm. Okay, dash of salt. This calls for a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. Yeah. That's not enough cinnamon. Come no on. way. Wait, what about pumpkin spice? No, let's not be ridiculous. We're just gonna try this normal way. We can we can do a hybrid on another day. Actually. Because it calls basically for like cinnamon and nutmeg and like. All the ginger. stuff that's basically in pumpkin spice. Ginger is the <laughs> next thing. But um, I feel like I, since I'm going to be counseling you on how to open a box of pie crusts and lay them in a pan, then I think that you should be the next one to make an apple pie. You and Dylan, you guys can watch this video and learn from it, and then you can make a pie and have it ready for Mommy and Daddy. Mm -hmm. Think that'll happen? Mm. We can have pie for dinner. No promises. Okay, so mix up your stuff, your dry stuff, and then you're going to toss it with the apples. And then you can open your accidental vegan pie crust, lay it in a pie pan. Although the crimping, 
You don't, I don't think you know how to cramp. I'm going to show you how to cramp. I don't even know what that word means. Oh, well, huh, now I know. I'm going to add this here sprinkly stuff and give it a toss. Try Just to get most toss. of it. Try to get most of it in the bowl. Oh, I think yeah. I did get most of it in the bowl. Whoa, go me. Come on. Come on, come on. So if we have this for dinner, no, that's pie for dinner. Yeah, it's pretty much health food, right? Don't You're eating don't fruit. She never let me have dessert for dinner. But I don't think she's on the YouTube, so. It's only dessert if you eat ice cream with it. Otherwise, you're basically eating health food. I've never opened one of these before. This is my first time using, oh, using little rolls. That's oh. pretty neat. How do you use that? That's pretty neat. Oh, it's round so I can really just unroll it. I'm wow. liking that. So you don't even have to roll it out. I thought it would be, okay. Huh? You thought it'd be a square? No, I, I can't. A ball? I thought, I don't know why I thought the shape of the box should have been a clue, but I thought that it was like <laughs> in, a, in a triangle. <laughs> <laughs> like folded in quarters. I did. I thought that. Huh. I'm feeling less than intelligent at this moment. Hey, welcome time. to my life. Yeah, okay. I know. I feel every day. All right. So I'm going to read my recipe book over here and see if I'm sometimes you're supposed to poke holes in your um, crust. Sometimes you're not. I'm not sure which this is since I don't make pies the way I used to. Okay. Turn into pastry line pie plate. Hmm. Doesn't say anything about poking holes, so I guess I will not poke holes. Don't, that's raw. No. You just ate raw pie stuff. Oh, don't be calling me and take you to the ER when you've got yourself a bellyache. Mm -hmm. You know what's good, all this stuff here? If you just saute it up in a pan, you put it on top of French toast or pancakes. It's pretty good. I wouldn't argue with it. And you know that new oven we got over there? It's got the it's griddle. got a griddle in the middle. Are you going to be able to fit all that in there? Oh, I'm motivated. <laughs> it's called like a mile high pie. There's nothing oh. wrong with having a tall pie. People okay. like tall pie. And then you dot it with butter. I mm. don't know why. It's just something that apple pie bakers do. Daughter. So that's just called dotting with butter. Yeah. You just throw butter in randomly. Randomly, <laughs> and I don't. I as I said, I don't really know why. It's just what the recipe calls for. Hmm. I've always done it this way. You know, the less healthy you make it, the better it tastes. That's why it's called dessert. Cram as much fat in there as you can, because you know, like when I cook dinner, dinner, I cram as much veggies in there. So this is like the counteracting part. Mm. I mean, this is probably. This is basically. I mean, this is kind of like dinner for Dylan, though. Yeah. Fruit and butter? <laughs> Dylan does like his butter. Butter, 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 butter. They used to be a commercial, believe it or not. <laughs> at Christmas time. Believe it or not. Uh, what? Are you making a play on I Can't Believe It's Not Butter? Yeah. Uh, no, it used to, that was a commercial. It, that was the song. Butter, 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 butter. Okay, oh, no. we're going to get ready. Is that the 90s? Might have been even 80s and 90s. They had really cheesy stuff. I mean, not that the 60s and 70s didn't have cheesy stuff. Yeah, the, the, I feel like the 80s were the cheesiest. Yeah. Did like Did you know it was cheesy in the 80s? Like, were you like, this is okay? Really cheesy. Well, just to be fair, your father and I never ever liked disco. <laughs> we knew that was cheesy. There was no doubt in our minds that it was wrong, and we would tend to shun people that would listen to anything but rock and roll. I'm driving around. That's rolls. right. <laughs> okay, now the crimping like part. Like Loverboy? Loving every minute of it. Yeah. Okay, that. crimping. This is how you crimp. Oh. I told you? Oh, yep. Well, you already told me how. Yeah. Earlier. But I don't know how to explain it with words, so I'm just going <laughs> to show you. Push your finger between you the other two fingers. Your your forefinger and your thumb into a V. Are you talking like Pee Wee Herman or something? <laughs> I don't know. Is that how he talks? I don't know. I, I haven't actually seen the show, but I think I've seen clips on YouTube. And I think that's how he talks. Didn't he have some kind of trouble in a movie theater? Uh, yeah, probably. I think he asked for extra popcorn or something. and he. I think part of his body got stuck in the popcorn. Yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> yeah, right? Then we're gonna cut slits in it to vent it, and then so it can let out its anger. And then 
And then what? I don't know. I'm just like, and then we're the, gonna put the dude little where, dude. Where's my car? Is that the the movie I'm referencing? I can't know that, Craig. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you and Dad used to reference it when we were kids all the time. Dude, where's my car? I I don't know what you're talking about. I think that's it. Was that something with Ashton Kutcher in it? Yeah, you Super. do know what I'm talking about. It was on <laughs> while I was reading, <laughs> and it was terrible. It was a terrible, <laughs> terrible movie. Where's my pairing up? The terrible movie. Okay, so now you're going to cut is. your. Nope. That's a bread knife. This mm. is a paring knife. Just cut eight little slits in there, and that way it's already marked for sizes. Mm. And I hate to tell you this, Craig, but this is only going to make eight pieces. Well, you can just leave that one for me. Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> and we have to save some for Lee and Jimmy. They'll be uh. here tomorrow. Because you know darn well this is going to be on Instagram. And they're gonna see it, and they're gonna be like, oh. Hey, I don't have to post it on Instagram. What, what are you gonna post it on Instagram? I might. Yeah, I you gotta make an Instagram account just for that. I have one. I have thirty-one I mean, followers. You don't even do anything on it, do you? Not really. <laughs> Ever? <laughs> Not really. Not with the Hercules one. Okay, so you put this little foil bumpers around here. You get said to put it on there, and then so it doesn't get all burny. And mm. then you uh, take it off for like fifteen minutes or some such thing. Hmm. How's that, that? Like make it not get burnt. It just prevents it from the exposure to the circulating hot air. Mm, that's it just a big word. Shields it. Hot. Exposure. Hot air. Circulating. Hot air. That's my boy. He's got the hot I'm air. All of it. Like a balloon. Okay. So let's see. You're welcome. Blah blah blah. What did you do? Nothing. Don't worry about it. Cover edge with three inch. Oh, I hope that was a three inch strip. Oh form. no, if it's not. Can you measure that for me? I, the measuring tape? Uh, my measuring tape book. Yep, mark that's right there. Uh, three inches. Okay, thank you. You saved my life. Yep, you're welcome. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Cook until cut crust is brown and juice begins to bubble. 40 to 50 minutes. Okay, so we'll put it in. I'm thinking for the 40. And then we'll take a look see and pull off the uh, foil bumpers at the appropriate time. Hello, oven. This is my first time putting something in you. I hope you enjoy your experience in this house, and I also hope that you last for 30 years like my last one did. Do you think she was listening? I don't know. She's still pretty young. I don't know if she understands you just yet. Do you think she thinks I'm crazy? I don't think she understands. has a concept of crazy just yet. She's really young. She will. What are we saying? Let's do 35. Here's one thing I don't like is you gotta stand here. You can hold it down. <laughs> Mom, technology's hard. Well, our timer over there, the battery <laughs> operator, you gotta keep pushing it. Uh -huh. So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Start. So, that's, thank you for learning me that. Are that's you supposed good. to do it for 40 minutes? I'm gonna do 35 because this is it for the last 15 minutes. Oh, Take right, it right, off, right. So, that will be a maximum of 15 minutes. That's just math, Craig. Tongue in cheek. Ha ha ha, so funny. Mm hmm So you want to remove your foil. Good. <laughs> and close her up again. And then uh, set the timer again for another 15. Can she do it? Okay, don't tell me how to do it. <laughs> I'm just going to do it. Timer. Whoa, that's fast. Oh. <laughs> Can you go into the negatives? Negative time? Oh no, I, I gotta take it out. I think it's better if I do it this way. <laughs> <laughs> no, <more laughs> things going off. Oh, I'm so confused. Too many cooks, too many cooks. That's how the song goes, just like that. Doesn't it? Yeah, just like that. I thought so. Oh, it smells good. Yeah, that's a good sign. Mm hmm Let's turn the light on. It looks like apple pie. Yeah, it's like oozing out. Yeah, I'm going to say five more minutes. What? Really? Oh, yeah. I thought it was done. Because nope. it's like oozing out, you know? Yeah. They look done. Is it gonna brown down the crust right there? Yeah, I guess that's done. Baker Craig says. <laughs> I done. know so much. 
Yeah, about eating it. Mm-hmm. It's been, what, like an hour or something? Close or more, to. Probably more than that. <laughs> probably less than that. Probably less than that? No, we're just getting really impatient because it was it? it's like t almost 10 o'clock. Yeah. It's time for dinner. Yeah. In Max's house, it's time for dinner. This is like when they eat dinner. Then the do house. they go right to bed? No. Well, I don't know, because the parents have jobs. Like, they well, that's holding together age. fairly nicely. Yeah. So I guess it's. I mean, it is like you can tell. Like here, like it definitely, it definitely is still a little bit too hot. Yeah. You can actually move, you know, move the camera a little closer. Yeah. It's definitely still too hot, but we're impatient. So. Mm-hmm. Not one to waste, are you, Craig? No. Not when it comes to pie. Okay, not super hot. It's not that spicy. And I put in double the cinnamon because that recipe called for, <laughs> called for a half a teaspoon, which that's not much. Yeah. I put a tablespoon in my oatmeal in the morning. No. Yeah. Yeah, definitely tastes the cinnamon. How's the flakiness of the crust? Oh, I actually haven't even gotten any crust. I only got the, the stuff that's been spilling out so far. I didn't get that much crust on that one either. I'm gonna just go over here. Dad, what are you doing? I'm watching. Why don't you try it? You're the real apple pie connoisseur here. Yep. I'm watching you though. Yeah, it's like. I think the crust is. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I'm watching them. Well, aren't you gonna have some? What if he eats it all? This yeah. Is... There's only one piece left, Dad. I'm okay. Um. Yeah, I think the crust is really good. Pillsbury, Pillsbury nailed it. Nailed it. Nailed it. Smells awesome. Mmm. -mm. Man, this is what a gr girl should have. This for perfume. This is this is be better. I think you want like Thanksgiving <sighs> stuff as perfume. Yeah, that'd be that'd be great. Hmm. Not that smelly stuff. Dad's dating tips. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hmm. How to land? How to land your man? Yeah. Just walk around with an apple pie. Yeah. Mm -mm. Mom, do you think I got my taste testing from Dad? Well, how is it, Craig? Mmm, good. Okay, then yes, you did. <laughs> good that's stuff. What, that's what Dad always says. Mmm, good. Mm. Well, there you go. You just missed the good. Are the apples cooked properly? Yeah. Not too soft. I don't know. I might have to have another piece. Yeah. We have to save some for Leah and Jimmy. Uh, no, we need, no, we don't. I don't need to post about it on Instagram. And they're going to know. I can wait they to post this video in like a know. month. They will they think they're going to watch our channel. They won't know. <laughs> They'll never know. People always know about things you don't want them to know about. They know. I'll deny we can it. all just promise not to post anything on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Tara, if you post anything on Instagram, just delete it. I'll deny it. She's my daughter. I have to save her a piece. I only make apple pie every two years. You make another one. You make another one. <laughs> Craig knows how. I just taught him how. Right, Craig? Craig can't know how. Watch the video. You wish you were me? Yeah, because then I'd be eating apple pie now instead of holding this camera. <laughs> Alright, we'll let you put down the camera and you can eat it too. Okay.